<clears throat> all right guys what's going on so this is going to be uh weight loss journey update number one or whatever you want to call it but real quick i just kind of want to talk about what i'm doing um what's working what's kind of not working for me and um uh, and then at the end of the video we're gonna do the weigh-in and all that type of stuff it's actually Thursday right now, but I'm not I'm not doing the weigh-in or the video until Sunday. So today I'm just gonna kind of talk about, like I said, what I'm doing. On Sunday, I will do the weigh-in and kind of uh, the measurements and we'll see kind of what's changed, if anything. Um, I'm still continually to weigh in every morning. That's just something I like to do. So I know I've kind of lost a couple pounds uh, this week and um but i'm really interested to see what that's going to look like on sunday um so sunday i'm not really sure how i'm going to do the weigh-ins from here on out so this is something i hadn't thought about because um my normal job i work on on sundays i go in at 5 a.m i get off at uh, um 5 p.m on sundays but I want the video to go up Sunday afternoon. So, but I also want to weigh in first thing in the morning, um, you know, without anything in my body uh, to determine, you know, I, I just like to weigh in first thing in the morning uh, after I go to the bathroom. So, um, so I'm not really sure how I'm gonna do that. <laughs> so just kind of work with me on that. Uh, we'll kind of, uh, I'll figure out kind of a system or what works best for me and then uh, I'll let you guys know so that way you're kind of up to date with everything that's going on. But, so this week I've been really excited to try something different. Something that in the past I've looked at as um, just not a good option for me because I thought I was too active. Um, but I've been trying the intermittent, intermittent, it's hard for me to say, intermittent fasting this week. So, I've watched some videos, I've done a little bit of research, and there's a lot of good things that come from intermittent fasting. I'm not gonna get into those in this video, I'm just gonna kind of tell you kind of what I'm doing and uh, why I think it's working for me. So, um, it's what's called a 16 on, eight off intermittent fasting. So, so 16 hours of the day I'm not eating. So the only thing I'm doing in those 16 hours is I'm able to drink black coffee and water. And I, I, you don't wanna put in one calorie um, in your 16 hours of fast. Sometimes my fast is 17 hours, sometimes it's gonna be um, 18 hours, just kinda depends on when the last time I eat the night before. So basically here's what I'm doing. So from, from 2 p.m. every day, so 2 p.m. I'm able to start eating at 2 p.m. And I have up until 10 p.m. that night. So that's my eight hour window to eat. And then I go to bed. Um, and so from roughly from 10 p.m. till 2 p.m. the next day, that's when I'm fasting. I'm drinking nothing but water. I do drink coffee in the mornings. Um, I've been drinking probably about half a pot. And then I'm just trying to drink water throughout most of the day. And then at 2 p.m. I get to eat. And what, what's been working for me so far is at 2 p.m. I've been eating a sandwich, which is uh, whole wheat bread, which is, it's kind of the honey wheat bread. Um, it's kind of pretty popular now. I really, I really like it. I like it better than white bread. So I've um, been eating the honey wheat bread and I've been eating, I've been getting like the packages of meat from Walmart. Um, so the bread is two slices of bread is 130 calories the package of meat is 100 calories so now we're up to 230 and then i've been eating uh i've been having a slice of cheese with that also so i think that's another 60 so all together like 290 i i rounded up and just say 300 calories uh for that one sandwich and then so at two o'clock i've been eating a sandwich and then a protein shake so the protein shake i really don't know the calories, I, I forgot to look. I, when I kind of opened it, I ripped the plastic off of it. I do know per serving, it's about 30 grams of protein. I'm guessing probably, I don't know, maybe 100 calories, some, somewhere around there. 
uh, but the carbs are low, the sugar is low. And uh, so basically, roughly I'm getting about 40 or 400 calories in that first meal. Um, a lot of protein and obviously some carbs, uh, but that's been working well for me. And then a couple hours later, um, I might have another shake. I might have a uh, another sandwich. And I've just been bringing sandwiches just because it's just easier for me. I can pack a sandwich. Um, I like sandwiches. Um, I really don't get tired of sandwiches. So um, it's easy for me to kind of pre-make, put it in a bag and, uh, and bring it. So I'll show you kind of real quick. Um, so there's my protein shake. All I gotta do is add water. I already have the scoop in it. And then here are my two uh, sandwiches that I've made for the day. So, uh, so like I said, and that, that usually gets me until I get home. And like I said, I've been drinking water. I do have like three full gallons of water in the back of my truck that I've just been keeping there uh, so I can have it. And uh, since it's been kind of, since it's in the winter time, it's cold at night. Um, it really hasn't been getting that cold, so I'm not worried about them freezing, but they are staying cold, so I just keep them in the truck. Um, so what else? Um, so in the evenings, you know, for dinner, um, so a couple times I've had um, hamburger patties with cheese on them, with some ketchup, uh, no bread, been eating that. Um, I've been e eating some, uh, some peas, so, um, and then, and then, so once or twice I've had like an apple with some peanut butter, um, kind of like my pre midnight or pre bedtime meal. So like 9.30, nine o'clock, 9.30, somewhere around there, I'll have an apple with some peanut butter, just kind of dip the apple in the peanut butter. I love peanut butter. So, uh, that's just kind of where I'm at right now. And I'm not really trying to count a whole lot of calories. I know I'm at a deficit. Um, you know, like I said, a sandwich is 300, so you're talking six. Um, I'm probably somewhere around 1,500 calories for the day, um, give or take 100 or so. But for somebody my weight, you know, I think I looked it up the other day to where I would have to maintain like 2,700 calories a day to maintain the weight that I'm at. So, you know, if I could try to stay around 2,000 calories a day, I'm, I'm good with that. Um, so yeah, that's just kind of where I'm at. And that's where I'm actually feeling really good. So right about now, it's almost 1230. You know, I can feel myself starting to get hungry, but it's not a, it's not like I'm starving. Um, I'm just, I'm just a little bit hungry. I want to eat. So. Uh, the biggest problem that I've had so far, and I've done a really good job, but I can see it becoming a problem in the future, that two o'clock meal, if, if I'm not really careful and I'm not disciplined, there's, a, there's gonna be a tendency to eat too much on that meal. And because, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll eat my sandwich and I'll drink my shake, but I'm still hungry. If, if I just let it sit for like, 20 to 30 minutes then I feel I feel like I'm kind of back to normal and I'm not and I'm not hungry anymore but like I said there's going to be a tendency to overeat and that's that's where I, I have to be disciplined at um, so uh, that's kind of where I'm at I, I can see kind of that that being my problem um, but so far the intermittent 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 fasting has worked really well i'm really happy i feel good i feel like i'm losing weight you guys kind of know that feeling when you're kind of in the zone you feel like you're losing weight um that's kind of where i'm at so i've worked out a couple nights this week in the evenings i'm scared to work out in the mornings right now because of the intermittent fasting i'm scared i don't know how my body's going to react i don't really know so my plan is is to try the intermittent fasting this week work out a few times in the evenings once i got some food in me and then next week i'm going to try a day to work out early in the morning so ideally that's what that's what i want to do but i'm just i'm just a little bit worried that i'm going to work out in the morning and that's going to kind of put me where i'm super hungry and i don't want to get to the point to where i'm kind of um, oh, 
what do you call it, um, where you're kind of uh, shaky and you're starting to kind of get a little bit delusional. That's happened to me before when I've worked out really hard without eating. Um, so I'm, I'm a little bit worried of that. So that, that's why I haven't been working out in the mornings. And because of that, I haven't been able to work out as much this week because, you know, I, I have to take my daughter to practice one night. So I'm not really able to work out and just other things. So I'd rather work out in the morning and stay consistent that way. But for me, like I said this week, I just want, kind of want to try out the intermittent fasting. I wanted to see how my body was going to react. And then next week, I want to throw a workout in, see how my body reacts. Hopefully, I'm good to go. Hopefully, it's not too terribly bad. And uh, and then that's kind of what I want my routine to be going forward. Uh, once lawn care starts, I'm really not sure how this is all going to play out as far as the intermittent fasting, because I'll be burning more calories throughout the morning, uh, mowing and working and things like that. So I'm just not really sure. But for right now, this is something I kind of want to try. I want to give it a good try and um, and see what happens. So anyway, guys, that's kind of what's working for me right now. Um, it's only been four days. So this is the fourth day I've been doing it. Um, like I said, I feel great. But, uh, but this is something I definitely want to address going forward and kind of let you guys know how my body feels, how it's reacting. Do I feel like I'm losing weight? Do I feel better? Do I have more energy? Um, so far, everything is, is good to go. Um, I haven't been able, I haven't been restricted in any way doing the intermittent fasting like I thought I would 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 be. So anyway, this is going to be the Sunday upload. Uh, right now, I'm going to show you guys my uh, my weight and all the measurements from the app, and then uh, we'll see you guys next week. All right, so it is weigh-in time. I'm going to take my shoes and socks off and uh, kind of empty my pockets out a little bit. It is Sunday afternoon, well, Sunday right around noon or so. I took off work a little bit early today uh, for some other stuff, so this is what I'm kind of weighing in. So the scale says 270.7. Let me try to get that on my app real quick. Okay guys, so here's all the uh, all the measurements. I'll put it up on the screen and then we'll kind of discuss this in next week's video. So we'll see you later.